Hello, my name is Montia Thompson. And my name is Derek Jamal Shah, and, and we, we are, are both seniors, seniors at, at King, King High School. School. We are also the winners of the 2014 Peloza Strozzi Essay Writing Competition. Students should participate in this program because it is a once-in-a-lifetime chance to travel to Italy and learn about art, architecture, and religion. People should also participate in this program because I feel like it's a very open experience and it also gets you really engaged and involved and in just learning new cultures and seeing different things. I guess one of my favorite parts of the program was really just seeing the other students and getting a chance to know them because it's rare that you have students that are out of state or friends that are out of state that you usually really know. So I think that was one of the biggest things that I took from this program. My favorite part had to be taking classes at the New York University in Florence. They had, like, the classroom was basically a big castle. It was so amazing taking classes there. I think one of the biggest things I got the experience is the fact that I think I'm interested in actually studying abroad now. And it's only because just being able to experience a different country to know um, other things about different religions, to learn different things about the different cathedrals, the people, the environment, and everything. It sort of made me want to experience the world more and actually see it as raw as it could be. What I got out of the experience was knowing that there's something more out there than just Detroit. There's a whole other world out there to experience and discover, and it made me want to study abroad as well. One way uh, you can prepare for the essay, or you could have prepared for the essay, is basically mapping everything out. So you know when you read the package, you want to make sure that you have all your important details um, inside that stood out to you the most in the package and that seemed the most significant. So I think that's one of the biggest things um, that you should focus on when you're writing your essay. You should also focus on uh, not writing all of it at one time. Sort of take your time and take out uh, little things that stand on the packet every day and just write it down. And it'll be easier to put it all together. And then the final thing is, I think the critique, um, the critiquing and the editing of it. You want to make sure that your essay stands out the most, so you, you know you want to get to the facts and you know you want to have the important details, but you also want to have a little flavor that sort of um, separates you from all the other winners because everyone has a different writing style and everyone has uh, their way of thinking, a, a totally different way of thinking. So just putting uh, other things like little minor um, side notes or just little jokes or um, little fun facts or things that you saw connect to the real world versus um, the topic, I think it'll also help you um, advance to being one of the six finalists or also being the winner of the Palo Chosen Program. Uh, one way to prepare for the trip if you're a winner is the first thing is to make sure you bring walking shoes, very comfortable walking shoes because you're walking all the time. Flip flops are not going to fly because there's so much walking and so much uh, stair climbing that it's literally a pain if you wear flip flops. But if you're used to it, then I guess you could do it, but I wouldn't listen to it at all. The next thing is to make sure you bring uh, important medication, asthma inhalers, uh, epi shots if you have them. If you have any allergic reactions, let them know. Um, I know one thing is I always carry it around my um, inhaler. Uh, the next thing is please watch out for the gypsies when you're in Italy because uh, they'll come up to you as if they're servants or if they're uh, clowns and stuff and they'll probably kiss you on the hand like they did me and ask you for money afterwards. And it's really scary because they get very aggressive to the point where they'll grab your arm and they won't let you go until you give them money. Uh, and the final thing is um, bring um, all the necessities. Make sure when you do go shopping you put everything inside of your uh, your big old luggage instead of your carry-on because if they catch the liquids, I think uh, over 3.14 ounces, they'll take it and throw it away. They threw away one of, uh, well, a couple of my um, items that I have for my mom and a few other people that I bought for the trip. But nonetheless, please have fun and I think it's gonna be a very good experience um, who has ever picked. So I wish you all the best of luck.
try talking to the students from the other cities in your group instead of just the children who are from Detroit and you know these are the only people I know I don't want to talk to anybody else try getting to know other people because outside of Pelosi or Strozzi you will still be friends with them we still talk to them and connect with them on Facebook right. we're all Sorry. really close friends and it's really great knowing people who live in New York, you know, Manhattan, Brooklyn, the Bronx, or kids who are from California, Los Angeles. Right. It is really great knowing those type of kids. 